Today I'll be doing an 8 inch schedule 10 stainless. I'm going to be doing this one in 2G position. Whenever you clean that up, make sure you clean it better than I did. I just did it basically just good enough, but I'll use the Tiger Disc to clean everything on the inside and the outside pretty good. I did three bridge tacks for my pipe with a 316 gap. Uh, you can use anywhere from 316 to a quarter. I usually use two, but I'm going to go ahead and use three tacks for this. Uh As y'all see right there, somebody stepped on my argon, she gave me porosity. So we're just gonna pretend like that doesn't exist. And running at 80 amps and I'm still using a 1 8 wire uh, whenever you do your cap I like to run at 80 amps because you want to take your time you do not want to rush because it might give you undercut and with 80 amps you're able to slowly walk the cup to get you a nice cap and it will also get you a real nice color now if you want your pipe to really have more color to it you can wait a few extra minutes to to when the pipe cools down then you can start capping. I didn't do that, but like I said, if you want your pipe to really look really good, that will be the key to give it more color. Here I'm running my top bead. Whenever you run your top bead, make sure you don't go too low 
you want to be able to keep both of the uh, beats even with each other. You don't want your top one to be too wide or bigger or wider than your bottom one. Same thing with your bottom one. You don't want it bigger than your top one. You want everything to look nice and uniform. So whenever you're running your bead, you drag your TIG rod down to about half of the cap. Here is the finished product. I hope you enjoy the video. As you can see, my beads look really good. Everything's nice and uniform. I have a pretty good color on there. If I wanted for it to look a little bit better, I could have waited for the pipe to cool off. But that will do for the video. Uh, as you can see, my beads pretty much match each other. And that's what you want it to look like. This is the root right here. As you can see, I have a rainbow in here. I got a nice color, except the little spot that I don't like, but we're not gonna dwell on that. We will keep it moving. Thanks for watching the video. I hope I was able to help somebody out. If you like the video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you want to watch the other video I'm going to upload next week of the 5G, make sure you subscribe so you can catch all the content that I will put out. I uh, hope to hear from y'all soon. See y'all next time.